Hey y'all, hey, raw to the bone. Well, I want to hop on here real quick because let me tell you the shit that happened to me today. Now, I done talked about the blended family. I done posted that on my YouTube channel. And so, for those who watch that, know how I feel about the blended family. But, this new generation... Um, I'm a grandmother of three, and I have my son young, and he started young, but just because the grandmothers are young, does that mean the level of respect gets younger? No. Yes, I am a very active grandmother, but, okay, the highway runs both ways. I am not going to be humping it up no highway one way, one way, one way, one way, one way. Eventually, my ass going to stop humping, and my ass did stop humping. So now, she want to talk about I don't care about my grandbaby. That's a damn lie. You don't care about the relationship with your child and her grandmother because you would be making the same effort as the grandmother did in humping it up that highway. But you didn't. I don't remember my grandmother humping it up no highway to come see me. I was always taken to my grandmother's house, and as I got older, I found my way over there. And my son know damn better, because the same shit with him. So I don't know what this new shit is, but this is how shit can be fucked up in your family. But, <clears throat> that reminds me of another story. Yeah, my mother um, threw herself a birthday cruise, and I got laid off. So I didn't want to put the money forth for the birthday cruise, not knowing when I would be um, given some form of employment. Well, it's a fucked up story. Um, my mother said, since I had already said I wasn't going, she had roomed up with my cousin, but a third person can go free. I think all I had to pay was taxes or something or tips or something. Okay. I wasn't working. You know, my mother was looking out for me all the years I looked out for her mother daughter that's what we do supposed to do well my cousin had a fit and said no she didn't want me in the room with her and my and my mother my mother her aunt my mother So fine. I said, fuck it, I ain't going. <clears throat> My mother was upset. I had I had no idea. She had a conversation with her sister. Her sister then contacted me and said she removed herself from a room with that she was sharing with her daughter and her grandchildren. And she got a room for me and her, and she was going to pay my way. I was blessed. Thank you, Auntie. That family stepping up, looking out, sticking together. That's what I'm talking about. 
but you got the family members that just, you know, they don't have no glue. They just fall out. Or they have situational glue. They just stick to whatever the situation they, they like. But there ain't no loyalty. But I got more stories about the loyalty among my cousins. But for now, that cruise. So, my aunt paid my way. <clears throat> God blessed me with a job shortly after that. And I was able to pay for additional things. And also some excursions for the both of us. I offered to pay more and she would not accept it. Again. Thank you, Auntie. The whole time on that cruise, I felt the temperature. It was a heat. It wasn't no sun type heat. It was a shade heat. You know. Huh. My mother and my cousin wound up getting into it. My mother was very upset. It was just all very unnecessary. But the point of this story is, everybody got some fucked up shit in their family. Okay? Some don't talk about it, but hey. I'm here to talk about it. What I do. Well to the bone. Going for now, but not going forever. Peace.